dear ladies and gentlemen, Uzbekistan was on the junction of this uh, Silk Road. That's why beautiful type of art and craft we have, which have been reviving after independence. And we are at the miniature school. Davron Torshev did his best travel to different world museums to learn the technique of old miniature school of Bukhara after gaining independence of Uzbekistan. And here we are at his school where he has garden, he himself makes papers. And from six, seven years, he accepts students, local uh, children here, to teach beautiful uh, art of miniature of Bukhara. They cut and put in this pot. That's all. The rest will be firewood to boil it. Okay. And they boil it for 20 hours until it becomes a kind of porridge stuff. Then they take the porridge, go to the next section. Let's go and see. Assalamu alaikum, Mama. You see, this is a porridge. They just take by 200, 300 grams and big like this way. I don't know, I'm doing right or not. But to melt it more. Then, Okay, 80 liters of water they put here. 8 kilos of this stuff. They mix it nicely with water. Then they put a basket with a frame inside. Whatever comes on the basket. They leave for some minutes here, another the water drop. On top they put a cotton layer. Make it flat with a brush as he did. And on the top of other things. First they put paper on top cotton paper and they put this layer 20 times. On the top, they put very heavy stone or metal thing to press it for one day. And then, you see, here he puts the frame. Okay, he uh, put in this mixture of, okay. what, what does he make when he, it's all over, what are we making? Okay, we are making silk paper. After pressing uh, process of silk papers, these pieces are put on the board to dry them for one day. And then they take it to the main building to polish and the, then the paper will be ready to paint on the board. This is the raw silk paper, it's not polished one. You can polish silk, but it didn't it come is. from okay. it, it comes from the uh, mulberry tree. Mulberry, the second name of the mulberry tree is silk tree. Oh. Yes. Okay. As worms eat the leaves of this tree and make cocoon, that, and, and from the cocoon we take silk thread, that's why the tree is known as silk tree, because those worms only eat the leaves of this tree. And he's polishing it. Yeah, he's polishing it. Already polished one, ready one. Wow. This one is polished. Okay. 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 Okay.
I mean, to paintings on paper mache background. Uh, paper mache, I think you, everyone knows that it's a, a layers of paper, they glue and then polish, then draw the painting, and on top is covered with lacquer. All this work is done by the students here in Miniature School of Bukhara.